I'd always thought when I get in an airplane just before takeoff, on the tarmac, there are these huge curves, you know, where the planes move in. And every time I take off, I'd look out and I say, geez, why can't I do a curve like that? I don't like decoration. Uh, that it's like bad painting. Because uh, to me, a painting has to really mean something. To me, I mean, I mean, it's hard to say what it means, except what you feel and what what you can do with, say, a um, looking, investigating. Uh, I think that Diane Arbus once said, if you vesti investigate enough, everything becomes abstract. And I, I like that, and so I, I used it. I don't understand uh, exactly how I do choose color. I've done very few pink paintings or light blue, but I do like gray very much. I, I've done a series of gray paintings. When I mix a color, you know, you mix it. And you don't know how much you put into it. You, I mean, I don't do it by, by some people probably weigh it when it's powder or something. But anyway, they do it like a, a recipe for red. Or, but since I mix the pictures to an, with how many tubes I put into it, but I never paint the same color I can't. When I was three years old, uh, we lived in Pittsburgh, and the staircase from the upper floor down came down right in front of the front door. And in those days, in the uh, middle 20s, uh, it was very different. We never locked the front door, and uh, the milkman who brought milk and butter and stuff, cheese, I guess, opened the door and put it right on the mat in front of the door. It was one of these thick mats. And uh, I was coming, my, my mother tells me this because I didn't re really remember it. For, I mean, I remember coming down the stairs, seeing this yellow piece of butter, a pound of butter. Uh, I went to it and stepped on it. And I stepped on it, and the mat was bigger than this, but I stepped on it so it was all flat. Because, you know, I don't like bulk, thickness, three dimensions. My paintings have always been like planar. And so my mother came out and said, look what you've done. You've made art. <laughs>